man will spend four years in jail after stealing from the developmentally disabled. And new at six, we are hearing from some of the people he stole from. Here's Jackie Sprague with more. We feel angry and betrayed by Doug Carter's actions. Douglas Carter was sentenced today for stealing from some of Dayton's most vulnerable citizens as well as taxpayers. The 46-year-old will serve four years behind bars for the theft of more than $440,000 from the Montgomery Developmental Center in Huber Heights. He's also ordered to pay back the money and permanently banned from being employed in a position of trust with the government. Carter served as business administrator from 2009 to 2012. Because the center was almost like a family, it was, it was difficult for them to understand that someone could commit this level of offense. That's what led to uh, him being able to get away with this for so long. I want to use this um, to make myself a better person to be put into society. Um, I sincerely want to apologize. Ann O'Brien worked with Carter. She says he fooled everyone. He's already got caught. And, you know, it just amazed me that it took us so long to figure it out. He got what he just deserved, and hopefully he'll learn from it, and he'll wake up from it. And I hope he makes full restitution to the individuals that he can, because they live on $40 a month. That's not much. The center superintendent, Nancy Banks, says she was also shocked, and it's prompted changes. The department as a whole has um, revamped all the procedures and processes. Central office has been involved. And we do understand that it's our responsibility to improve processes and ensure that theft does not occur in the future. Jackie Sprague, 2 News, working for you.